This is Ricky Moore with the Burleson Star. I'm here with Burleson football coach Gary McElroy. And this is the week four edition of the two-minute drill. It's the first one of District 9-5A play. It's homecoming, or HOCO as the kids like to call it. The Elks are playing 730 Friday at Burleson ISD Stadium against the Granbury Pirates. Um, last When we last caught you, we were getting ready to play Weatherford. You lost a close one on a field goal late. Um, quick thoughts on that game? Um, you know, our kids, for the most part, played really hard. Uh, really impressed the way the defense played. And, and uh, you know, offensively, we just we made too many mistakes with too many turnovers, which, you know, proved costly. But um, even with uh, the turnovers, the game was tied uh, with 24 seconds left, and, and Weatherford was able to hit a, a field goal to win. So I was very encouraged, um, you know, the, you limit the turnovers and that's a totally different ball game. But uh, I was encouraged by the way the kids fought through adversity and, and overcame for the most part. Let's talk about the off week. How did that go? It was good. Um, you know, we, we got a chance to, uh, you know, put in some extra time. Uh, we needed to sit down after the three non-district games and look at ourselves and and you know, make sure we had all the right pieces to the puzzle in the right spot, you know, special teams and things of that nature. So we, we got some good work last week. Um, the heat, how's the heat been the last couple of days? It's been brutal. I mean, it's been rough. Uh, it's late September and you'd think you'd get a little bit of relief, but it's been Monday and Tuesday were some of the hottest days we've had. And Monday, you also tried to speed things up to get to homecoming parade. We were, so that really made it even yeah, harder, practice, I'm guessing. Uh, you know, we, we couldn't cut practice any shorter than what we did, you know, preparing for the game. Uh, but we had to really push the kids to uh, try to finish a little bit sooner so we could get to the parade on time. All right. Did you enjoy the parade? It was good. All right. Let's talk about uh, Granberry a little. Um, I cannot pronounce or I cannot spell the coach's name at Granbury now. It's an eye chart to me. But we just call him Coach Cheesy. Okay. Um, let's talk about his new coach there. And it, it, from what you've told me, it a little more consistent on offense. You kind of know what you're going to see. You're not guessing what the Pirates might come out at. Uh, at you know, they, uh, you know, obviously taking over late there in the summer. That staff is. Uh, you know, putting their stamp on it. Uh, you know, don't know a lot about them other than what we've seen on film. Um, you know, that's uh, Granberry always has some some good hard coach kids. Um, you know, so we'll just we'll just have to get out there and play our best. What do you kind of? Um, how do you approach a homecoming week? Well, you have to remind the guys that you know there are all, all these homecoming festivities. Uh, or because there's a game on Friday night. Uh, they don't play a game, you know, for a homecoming. You know, they have the parade, they have homecoming king and queen, they have pep rallies, and, and it all leads up to the game on Friday night. So you just have to keep them focused. Anything else? All right, let's go to who you got, Coach. You went three and two last time we did this, and you're now four and six, so you're closing in on 500. Um. BYU at West Virginia. West Virginia. All right. Uh, OSU, that's Oklahoma State, at Baylor. Oklahoma State. Georgia at Ole Miss. Ole Miss. Florida at Tennessee. Tennessee. Should I just give you Arkansas against A&M and just chalk it up? I'm going to take Arkansas, I guess. Okay. Anything else, Coach? You want to hit us with one last thing? No, I guess that's all I have. Hey, turn yeah. a little this way. No, the other direction. Is that a Cincy back there? Yes. I thought it was. Okay. So if you come to Coach's office, it'll at least smell good. Anything else? So I, How the kids doing? They're good. All right. Enjoy the ending of. Uh, I have not seen it yet. Oh, last ship. Haven't seen it. No. Figured you would go in there and watch it on the new TVs that Ralph uh, set up for you. On the ESPN Classic. Okay. What's on ESPN Classic these days? Football. All right. This is uh, Ricky Moore with uh, Burleson football coach, Gary McElroy, and this has been the Two Minute Drill.